Love and light, everybody. It's been a while since we did a spirit baby message. So tonight I am calling on the spirit babies, our spirit babies up in heaven, and we are going to see what information they have for mommy and daddy, mama and papa. All right, thank you. Ooh, thank you all for clicking on the video, showing your love and support to my channel, guys. I can't do this without you, and I'm very appreciative for all your love and support, okay? Father God, angels, ancestors, divine Holy Spirit, please go ahead and bless this channel, protect this channel, protect my intuition. Whatever anyone is sending myself, just return to them. If they are sending love and light, bless that back. And if they are sending the evil eye, just return to sender. I just like to teach the simple law that what you guys give out is the same thing you're going to get back, okay? So, spirit babies. Ooh, I'm already chills, guys. I love tapping into this energy. Spirit babies, what do we have to say? We're going to pull on some angel love messages. for. I think I'm going to do the divine masculine, the divine feminine, and then like what the spirit babies want to say. Okay, so for the divine masculine, spirit babies are saying simple acts of kindness. Kindness energizes you and brings happiness to those around you. And also connect with animals. So if I have any divine masculines watching, your angels and your spirit babies are saying to connect back with animals and to give small acts of kindness to people and place uh, people and things around you. Okay, anything else? Practice compassion. See things from a fresh perspective. And look at that spirit baby right there. Spirit baby has blue eyes and dark, like br light brown curly hair. And it's also wearing a, um, I think that's a lapis lazuli crystal on its neck. Maybe that resonates with you guys. I see a lot of blue and green. And um, the number six might be significant. Also, if you guys are noticing feathers around, I'm also hearing maybe you guys are um, noticing feathers when you're out and about. Those are your spirit babies. I'm also seeing little bl um, blue birds and squirrels. So if those, those can be also signifying that your spirit babies are trying to communicate with you, okay? But you need to start seeing things from a different perspective, I'm hearing. That's what your angel babies are saying. Anything else for the divine masculine? I'm, ooh, okay. I'm hearing divine feminine, so I'm just going to do that and now call on. What does the angel babies want to say to the divine feminine? Have faith. Trust your faith in this situation. Another angel baby there. Lots of butterflies. So I feel the divine feminine is going through this huge transformation, this huge rebirth, right? And um, your spirit babies are asking you to trust this situation. You might not see, I am so cold, guys. I can't, I don't know if you guys can see my goosebumps, but I am so cold. Okay. Um, your spirit babies are saying it might everything might not be into the way that you see it into the way that you've manifested it but they're asking you to have faith I'm hearing mommy have faith just have faith on us in us mommy we're putting everything will work out just have faith okay so that's what your spirit babies are saying 12 which breaks down to a three so that is manifestation that is creation i'm hearing get outside and for the divine feminine i can resonate with this i see butterflies like 50 butterflies a day i know now is the time to see them like in the um you know coming into spring is when you usually see them but guys i've been seeing butterflies these are the most butterflies I've ever seen in my whole entire life. Within the month of January to now, I've seen so many butterflies. So if the if the divine feminines that are resonating with this see butterflies around, those are your spirit babies, those are your angels telling you, just have faith, right? And I feel for the masculine energy, they might be noticing feathers or birds or squirrels, right? And that is your spirit babies and your angels saying, have faith and you know, practice compassion and simple acts of kindness. Can we get one more for the Divine Feminine? One more for the Divine Feminine.
One more for the Divine Feminine. Okay. Speak the language of love. Loving words have the power to change lives, including your own. Okay, so the Divine Feminine, whatever you're going through right now, um, speak those words of affirmation you know like whatever you want if you want more love i claim more love into my life i claim my spirit babies in i live an abundant life i live a happy successful stable life i am confident i am independent i am i am glorious i will be a great mother i am a great mother i'm a leader i'm a teacher all these love languages all these loving words you need to speak them in and i'm taking this for myself as well it's a good reminder to just remind ourselves that words have so much power and um it's time we need to you know just focus on the words that we speak because the one the words that we speak become our reality right and we want to be able to um manifest things in a greater way you know i might not have everything that i have right now but i know with the hard work that i put in and the time that i um spend i like to write a lot that's my thing um sometimes i may not speak my blessings out as much as i should but I'm, i like to journal them and write them a lot and so um for me that's just something I do, but I'm going to take that as well and start more um, just speaking that into my life. Okay, so let's see what else wants to come out for the spirit babies. Indigo child, we also saw this indigo child with this blue um, crystal on the, on the neck. So that could be an indigo baby that's going to be birthed. communication baby communication okay we are going to be healthy and very tapped in so these children are going to be very spiritual children i feel because mommy and daddy are both on this on this path you know the spiritual path and so when you guys actually come into counter past lovers are up to no good trying to pull on your energy okay yes and i could feel this personally in my life like i know that there's a lot of karmic energy going around right now um and your spirit babies are just confirming that so if you guys have been feeling anxiety if you guys have been feeling just lethargic and if you guys have been feeling frustrated just know that that is not your energy and return it out acknowledge it work through it and return to sender okay that is exactly what i do all right so what do your spirit babies want to come in and say for the divine masculine first card is we are going to be papa's world and mommy's whole heart uh, so both of you guys i'm also hearing even if you have children from previous relationships of course you love your children and all of your children are blessings but i'm hearing these children that you're going to be having with your divine counterpart it's going to be love babies like these children are going to be strictly born out of love out of that creation of love unconditional love okay rub mommy's back and she'll fall right to sleep so daddy your spirit babies papa your spirit babies are giving you insight on what to do when mommy's restless or when mommy needs a little more um care rub her back and she'll fall right to sleep anything else for this divine masculine Eat fruits and veggies when you are in your belly. I feel that's for the Divine Feminine. You will have sweet cravings for the Divine Feminine. Daddy, Papa dreams of you. That's us telling him what he needs to do. Daddy wants to get to know you, Mom. Okay. Your animals will keep us safe. Don't worry. Mommy loves Daddy. Daddy loves Mommy. We love you both. Just com confirming what I said about this love child. These are going to be love children, right? Based on that unconditional love. We are water babies, okay? We always see these water babies, these indigo children, these 
you know, these very tapped in babies. This is going to be the, the collective babies that are going to be born. So we need to make sure we keep our children connected to nature, connected into Mother Earth, into the water, and then a summer baby. So maybe some of you guys will be, wow, twins at the bottom of the deck. So maybe some of you guys will be um, having twins. Maybe some of you will conceive in the summer or um, give birth in the summer. Anything else these spirit babies want to come and say? Can we get any genders of these spirit babies? What kind of genders that we'll have for the collective? Okay, we'll take these and then we'll close it out. It says, we will be with you soon. Get, read, get things ready. Okay, mommy, daddy's coming home soon. Okay, keep your pregnancy on the down low. Past people will not be happy. Just like how we saw that, um, you know, past lovers are trying to um, manipulate the energy. These past lovers are not going to want to see um, the divine masculine and the divine feminine happy and thriving. That's just going to upset their demons. So you don't want to go and publicly display everything. Of course, not hide your baby and live in fear. That's not what they're saying. But just keep this baby a little more sacred, right? A little more to yourself, I'm hearing. Rub mommy's feet and show her love when we come. Mommy has hairstyles already picked out. Daddy needs you, mommy. He's hurting and new beginnings are on their way. Okay, they're telling me get a couple more. So daddy needs mommy, mommy needs daddy. I feel you guys are both calling out for each other and the spirit babies can uh, feel that. We communicate with you through music. So guys, that's how your spirit babies are communicating with you. If you guys feel deep connections to music, it's because there, um, there's messages in the songs that are trying to get through to you, okay? We protect you while you sleep and send you messages. So I'm also hearing some of you guys, most of you guys have already been dreaming about your spirit babies. Most of you guys have been getting downloads, ooh, chills, yes. So most of you guys have been getting downloads and dreams about your spirit babies. They've been communicating with you. What kind of dreams have people been seeing? I'm seeing um, an image of somebody maybe dreaming of their spirit babies, like more of an older child, maybe one, one and a half, two. Um, I'm seeing a baby girl um, like on a playground setting, swinging in a swing, sliding down a slide, um, little shoes on, tights. These are the images that I'm seeing. So maybe some of you guys have been dreaming about that. Um, I'm also seeing a baby boy about the same age, just learning to walk and balance, um, kicking a ball with with dad in the park or something. So maybe some of you guys had that image in a dream. Um, beautiful. So we got boy and girl energy of what I'm envisioning. Any energy wants to come out in the cards? They're saying, as long as I'm healthy, that's all that matters. I feel in this reading, they don't, I don't know, but they don't want to drop too much information of gender because I feel that doesn't really matter. But when I saw twins and then I'm looking at that, these look like twin boys as well. So take it how it resonates, guys. Communication, baby, communication. So your spirit babies are saying there needs to be some form of communication some kind of communication needs to be had between mommy and daddy something and we saw um in the reading below if you guys noticed it was the divine masculine coming in with communication right dropping that player like energy and now coming in to express in a romantic way so that is very beautiful is there anything else that the spirit babies want to say to mommy and daddy mama and papa wow it says mommy we are twins get ready so that's the second confirmation that there's twins mommy use your discernment when new people come in okay so i feel like when this baby and then we have winter baby and spring baby well wow, so we have summer winter and spring okay so guys you could conceive or give birth in any one of these i feel if some of you guys conceive between now and what 
April, ending April, then it will be conceived in the winter. And then if you guys conceive, you know, um, July in the, you know, July, August, September, it will be a spring baby and so on. So um, get ready guys, because these babies, you look, they're, they're all timings of the year. These babies are coming, right? But um, with this card, mommy, use your discernment when new people come in. I feel like when these babies, because now I'm getting twins and now I'm addressing babies. So I'm hearing fraternal as well. So maybe some of you guys will be having fraternal twins. Um, I'm getting very chills as well. So I feel that is confirmation for a lot of people. But um, when these babies are born, there's going to be new people entering your life. You know, new babies, everybody loves new babies and there's going to be family and new people that you're meeting, whether this be like baby play dates and whatever it is, little groups that you go to and your spirit babies are just saying, please be discerning, okay? I mean, yes, it is nice to get out and meet people, but these babies are going to be highly tapped in. So you have to be really selective who you let around your children, okay? Who you let carry your children is what I'm hearing, okay? So... That is all with that. We're going to go ahead and get one angel message and then we'll close out for tonight. A very short reading, but you know, I think it's short and sweet. You know, jam packed, short and sweet. Just what we need. Okay. I'm hearing mommy, we love you. We can't wait to see you. Daddy's excited. He's going to be so attentive, is what I mean. Heart chakra. Love is the heart of the matter. Your heart is the center within your physical being, attuned to most, attuned most to love. It's safe for you to love and be loved with an open heart as we stand by with the perfect protection and guidance. Okay, guys, so if this past person comes back, if this new person comes in, if this communication comes in, your spirit guides and your angel babies are saying they are protecting you. Okay, of course, use your discernment. Use your discernment, but you are highly protected and highly favored. It is time for you guys to tap into your heart chakra. Let's go ahead and do a little sound healing. to open up your heart chakra, rid any blockages, heal any traumas. When you listen to that sound, it will help you clear out the energy. Soon I am going to be doing a little video of just sound healing on its own. So you guys can click on the video if you feel called to, to open up your heart chakra, relieve blockages, uh, release blockages, and claim in more love into your life. Um, guys, that is the reading for tonight. If you enjoyed it, please go ahead and give this video a thumbs up. Show your support. Show that it resonates. And if you feel called to subscribe, please subscribe to the Intuitive Family. We are growing by the day and I couldn't do it without you guys. My information is down below if anybody wants to reach out to me, donate to the channel, book a reading. It is down below. Thank you all so much for your love, support, and your blessings. And I will see you in the next reading. Bye.